Negative. That's the word tonight from Public Health Surveillance Officer Timothy McLaughlin Monroe on suspected dengue cases. He says results for five of the last remaining dengue tests are back and the patients are disease free. That brings a total of dengue free cases to 18. But there's still one more pending. Cayman 27 C for Russell Jr. has a story. As the region battles a growing dengue outbreak, Cayman has managed to remain dengue free. And so far, we've received 18 results, all negative, and we have one pending, and we suspect or hope that that will also come back negative. Last year, Cayman recorded two dengue cases, and while Mr. McLaughlin Monroe welcomes the low numbers, he says the possibility of dengue reaching our shores is still there. So we do have that risk of importing a case because we have flights to and from, and we have people that go back home and come back. And he says there's nothing we can really do to stop it. Some diseases, there's not much you can do about it. I mean, there's no travel restriction. It doesn't, you know, so we just have to live with that. As the public health department awaits the single pending case, Mr. McLaughlin Monroe says everyone has to do their part to keep Cayman dengue free. So if we just clean up and, and eradicate the breeding sites, we also would limit the, the, um, the amount of this mosquito. There's no word on when the results on the last dengue case will be released. Seaford Russell, Cayman 27. And Mr. McLaughlin Monroe says so far for the year, 500,000 cases of dengue have surfaced in the Caribbean region. And there have been more than 300 related deaths.